Well, another day, another cert. Uh, so this time I got CompTIA Data Plus. So this is a basic data analytics, uh, working with data type uh, cert uh, certification. Um, so you know what? while we go on, let's just share this to LinkedIn. Happy day. And save. Cool. So, um, Data Plus. Uh, by the way, take a step back, Credly. Uh, I really like Credly. Not all certifications show up here, but it is a place where they can be managed by the third party, so you're not putting them in, you're not having to update them. Uh, and you can have your public profile visible, so you can see all of them. You can see that uh, Data Plus is down there below. Um, so let's look a little bit at uh, this exam. Uh, I'll link to all these down below. So the Data Plus exam objectives. So this is what you really need to pull up if you're going to study for them. It's good to get a book. It's good to get um, a lot of po uh, things to help you. Practice tests, for example, are something that I use quite a bit. So I really like practice tests. Um, it can help gauge what uh, areas you need to study or not. Um, anyway, so talking about the areas, so they're usually broken up and you have percentages of the examination. So data concepts, data mining, data analysis, data visualization, data governance, quality and controls. Uh, in, interesting, one of the things I had to brush up on, it's been a while, uh, is the, in the data analytics part was um, statistics. So uh, brushing up on statistics a bit. Uh, so as you go through the exam objectives, they, they get more detailed. Now, even though they get more detailed, one of the things that they do not do um, is list, for example, the being familiar with the types of tools that are out there. Uh, oh, actually, right here. So there are here. You'd be good to have a general understanding of all of these um, if possible or at least enough that you can pass, right? Uh, we all wanna pass. Um, so, yeah, cool. So there's lots of information here. I'm not gonna go through them in the video, but I'll link to this down below. Um, there for uh, resources to study for this. I did use a book. Um, let me find that on Amazon. I'm gonna, I cheated and paused the video. Um, so Data Plus Study Guide, this is the one that I, um, that I used to study for the exam. Really, I just took the um, sample tests in it um, and ended up not having to use much of the book at all. I did uh, thumb through it. One of the things I thought was really cool, um, in fact, I'm gonna grab it really quick, just a sec. Okay, you're gonna see my chicken scratch notes. So I actually put notes um, as to think how I did and what I need to study. Um, as I'm going through and taking a sample test. But one of the things I really like that they have in here, because um, I'm constantly talking to students about the differences of databases, and they have um, uh, tables as to what, <laughs> um, what things are used in what databases. So you can understand a little bit the difference between Oracle, uh, MS SQL, MySQL. Um, and so that was good. So the different uh, val uh, values that can be assigned to fields um, or attributes and what they actually mean. Uh, so anyway, cool. Um, I've been on a certification journey for a little bit. I'm going to keep this up uh, and let's see where it can take me. So hope to see you in the next video.